Hello everyone, this is Leo Fonseca. Welcome back to my channel. Today I wanted to make uh, another video about the latest version of the UAD software. I know a lot of you guys are continuing to have this issue that uh, your interface is not connecting to your computer and not being able to run uh, the software. Um, and I wanted to clear some points uh, or some issues with you guys so you guys understand what's going on. And maybe this can help. And uh, again, if, if it doesn't, please contact me in my social media and I'll be able to uh, help. You know, I've been helping a lot of people and uh, not everybody has been successful, uh, but most, most have. We have been able to fix the issue and, uh, and it's been working really good uh, for them so far. But I wanted to share with you guys, um, you know, this, this, this first part that I know a lot of you guys are uh, uh, missing from the installation. Number one, I wanted to uh, uh, clear this uh, for you guys, and it is the fact that if you're gonna run the 9.15, which is the latest version of U the UAD software, it only, it only works with the M1 chip computers, okay? And uh, if you have the first version of the uh, MacBook Pros, that's fine as well. If, if you are uh, running the MacBook Pro Max version, just like the one that I have, uh, then uh, again, this version is the one for you, okay, to be able to install. Now, one of the things that uh, I wanted to make sure and you guys understand is that if you guys are running an Intel chip computer, which is a 2020 version, 19, 18, 17 uh, MacBook Pros, this version is not for you guys and that that's the problem that you know I've been catching with a lot uh, of the people that have contact me they want to run the latest version okay so I'm gonna show you guys how to or which version to use in order for this to be able to work okay but let's go back to the M1 before you uh, once you download before you even install everything the first steps that you gotta do is, you gotta click here on learn more, okay? When you click here, it's gonna take you to this, um, to this part of the website, okay? To this page. I am going to leave all the, the, um, uh, the links so you guys could just click on it directly, okay? And here, before anything, for all the M1 chip computers, you have to bypass all the security utility policies and all that uh, that are within you know uh, the the MacBook Pro so just take it you know one step at a time I did it uh, with you know again within 10 15 minutes and it worked but you have to do this first part before you install anything so make sure you do this okay and and you know, go, uh, you know, uh, one step at a time. And if you get lost, there's, you know, pictures uh, for, uh, for you guys to follow just to know where you guys are at and how it's supposed to look like, okay? After that, then you are able to install the, the newest version of um, the uh, UAD uh, software. And I'm gonna show you guys here. I'm running the latest uh, Luna version. I already have something up here. And here we go. no issues whatsoever, none whatsoever. And I'm also running, uh, I'm going to show you guys, I'm running uh, Wave plugins, okay, the new version as well. Make sure that you get the ones that are compatible with M1 uh, computers as well same process okay but the good thing is if you guys already do the security uh, policy thing uh, before you install uh, the uh, uh, UAD software you guys are not gonna have any issues with anything else okay because you only do it once um, so I'm running waves I'm also running the uh, Right here, Plugin Alliance as well.
with no issues. As you can tell, I'm not running anything else. Uh, it's a beautiful thing that I only see 8% <laughs> of my CPU because I have a lot of cores here. I think I have like 32 cores, so, but that's another subject that, you know, I'm gonna make another video uh, for that. But let's go back uh, to the other versions that you need to download if you are working with an Intel computer. Um, what I have been doing with a lot of uh, uh, a lot of the people that have been contacting me is actually installing this version here, which is the uh, 9.13.1. It's not the latest version of it, but I installed that one for some reason. That's the one that breaks the ice, you know, and then gets everything put to where it's supposed to, and and then I could go ahead and run the uh, 9.14.7 but another thing here this is only with Big Sur if you have a, a, an Intel computer and you're running Monterrey Monterey for all of you guys that speak Spanish um, it will not work okay just to let you know it will not work so Please, please uh, be careful with these versions that you guys are installing. If you guys are working with an Intel computer and you guys are working already with the Big Sur, this is the version, okay, that you guys need to install. If you guys are running uh, Monterey with an M1, okay, then you could install uh, the, the new version, but that's the only way. If you guys are running Intel, right, and you guys are already uh, uh, upgraded to Monterey, you guys are gonna have to downgrade, okay? Sorry, gotta downgrade uh, in order for this to work. If any of you guys still have any questions or, uh, you know, still having trouble, please contact me in, uh, in my social media or leave a comment, okay, if you guys, uh, you know, and I'll, I'll be able to, you know, answer any questions that, that you guys uh, may have. I've been helping a lot of people. Again, I'm not a software developer or not, you know, uh, I don't do code, any of that. But, you know, again, I've been able to uh, help a lot, a lot of you guys. Um, and again, you know, if you have any questions, let me know. Uh, but again, this small video, just wanted to make it so we could get this, you know, uh, clear for you guys and uh, make sure that you guys are able to follow the instructions if you guys didn't know about the you know the previous part or the, the the first part that you need to do before you install uh, the UAD software uh, and again it's working with my computer I'm running like I said the M1 Pro Max uh, in the latest version of uh, Monterey so I haven't had any issues and if I do, I'll make sure, you know, to go ahead and uh, record another video for you guys and let you know and what I did to solve that problem or go around that problem. All right. So, guys, if this video has been helpful to you guys, please give me a like, share it because it's going to help the channel, <laughs> of course. And uh, again, I'll be making more videos with more tutorials. If you have any specific uh, topic that you want me to talk about, go ahead and leave it on the comments and I'll be, you know, uh, uh, I'll be making the time for, uh, to be able to make these videos for you guys. All right, thank you very much for your time. I'll catch you on the next. See ya.